The following presentation will be on the classification of solids or three-dimensional figures. We will be working on identifying, classifying, constructing, and sketching them. Solids are three-dimensional or 3D figures that enclose a part of space. Now, For that reason, you might sometimes heard them, hear them called um, space figures or space shapes. Now, there are four basic types of, sil of solids. We have polyhedra, cylinders, cones, and spheres. Polyhedron being the singular form of the word, polyhedra being more than one, come from Greek words that literally translate to many faces. Now there are three D figures that have flat surfaces called faces that are made of polygons. Polyhedra can take many forms. The two examples that we cover for us of all purposes are prisms and pyramids. The parts of a polyhedron. We have the faces that are the flat surfaces of a 3D figure. Seen here with the red and yellow flat shapes. We have edges that are the segments formed by intersecting faces. Seen here with the silver bars. Vertices, where the edge, edges intersect. Singular form is vertex, so one vertex, more than one vertices. Seen here with the little golden balls where you have three or more edges meeting. Then we have bases, which are the top and bottom faces. So that's a special name for these particular faces. So the red that you see on top and that you cannot see on the bottom would be the bases for this prism. Here they are all together. Prisms are made of two congruent which means equal bases, top is a copy of the bottom, joined by parallelograms for sides. Now, if the sides are all rectangles, the prism is a right prism. The side edges form right angles to the bases. Pyramids are made by connecting a polygon base to a point, the point being called an apex. So if the apex is above the center of the base, directly above the center, the pyramid is a right pyramid. It means the height forms a right angle to the base. Now we'll only be covering the prisms and pyramids in class, but there are many other types of polyhedra. And here are a few examples. and there are oh so many more out there besides these. Now also we have cylinders, cones, and spheres. They are not polyhedrons because they have some curved, that means not flat surfaces. So any curved surfaces means that they are not polyhedrons, polyhedra. So a cylinder has two parallel congruent bases that are circles. A cone has one circular base and a vertex that is not on the base. And a sphere is a space figure having all its points an equal distance from the center point.